This is the home screen you will see after opening the app. To join the game, enter the game code and select Join Game. The game code will be announced shortly. Your screen will now look like this. On the top left is your team icon and team score. Six movement tokens showing the up and down movements. These are your two client types. Your equipment, you have oxygen and camps. Confirm move and cancel buttons showing as a tick and a cross. Over to your right are your guide inventories. The two guides are currently positioned at base camp. The spaces on the mountain are referred to as nodes. Moving clients, equipment and guides. An experienced client is being dragged across to the male guide. A camp dragged to the guide in the same way. Note the green information box appearing at the top right of the screen. These confirm each action taken. Moving up the mountain. To move your guides on the mountain, select the movement tokens you require. Drag your guides across the mountain, passing over each node on your chosen route. In this example, both guides will take the same route. Your move is not complete until you hit the green tick button. Up to that point, your move can be changed. Setting up camp, camp inventory and oxygen. To set up a camp, drag it from the guide inventory to the node you are on. The green ring indicates there is a camp now present. To open the camp inventory, click on the node. You can transfer clients and equipment by dragging them into the camp inventory. Drag the oxygen onto the desired client. Movement down the mountain. Red error messages. I will now attempt to move one of my guides back to base camp. I select a movement token and then move my guide back over the nodes all the way to base camp. I select the confirm button. I get a red error message. I have not selected enough movement tokens. To cancel the move, I select the red cancel button and my guide returns to its starting position. I try the move again with more movement tokens and this time my guide returns to base camp. Risk tokens. We open the camp inventory by clicking on the camp. Note the client's acclimatization points have increased to 5. I move the clients back onto the guide. The yellow exclamation marks that appear under the movement tokens are called risk tokens. These are rewarded for being the first team to move on any given day. Drag it onto a movement token and it will be swapped for a high value any direction movement token. I now select the movement tokens to summit the mountain with my male guide. I summit and move back down two spaces in the same move. Master Game Screen This is the Master Game Screen. Here you can track the progress of other teams. As you can see, Team 2 is currently two nodes down from the top after summiting. You will get live news feeds on the left displaying which teams have set up camps and have reached the top of the mountain. A leaderboard showing team scores and positions. A five-day weather forecast to help you plan ahead for your expedition. Note the current day's weather is highlighted. Keep a close eye on the forecast as adverse weather will affect your ability to move on the mountain.
These three numbers show you how many guides are allowed on a node at any one time on each of the altitude levels. Along the top of the screen is your daily countdown timer and a display of the current day. You are now viewing the game in training mode, where in a moment you will be playing a practice game before you embark on your expedition. Good luck, have fun and enjoy peak performance.